a little stroll, Johan. He, 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 he just he just wants to take a little ride. Got him. Stay pretty. Beautiful. I like that. Oh my goodness. Iguana people. So, we're at the expo today. Uh, we're waiting on a couple of guests that we're going to have. We're probably going to have the Iguana Man come in with us. Um, this place, is, it's being held like at a, at a hotel, I guess, at the La Quinta. The La Quinta Inn, you see it up there? Up there, Inn and Suites. I guess they must have uh, some kind of, um, you know, hall or something in there where people can congregate and show things and all of that stuff. So we're going to stick around. We're going to wait for our guests to show up. Then we're going in. I, I'm so excited about this aquacultural stuff. Um, it just brings me back to where I was, and I'm real happy about it. Stand by, guys. We're getting ready to have a good time. Look, look how we park here, okay? Hey, it's, it's we're tight, we're in the field, it's huh? Tight, it's tight, it's tight. Yes, sir, yes, sir. How's hey, welcome. Going? How you doing, man? Doing well, doing Glad well. Glad you came by. How you doing? Good. I'm Johan. So, uh, yeah, we're getting ready to have this show. Yeah, well, so tell me a little bit about what is this, man? I, I don't know. It, it was, it, I seen it was an aquatic expo. You know? So you know yeah. that I'm getting back into aquatics, as you've seen. Yeah. So um, I figured, you know, I want to come and check this out. I need a local for, stuff, Yo, so. for sure, man. It's right It's right in our neighborhood, too. Oh, yeah, especially, you know, especially since, you know, you've been fishing a lot lately. Right. You know, um, and you've seen the tanks that I've been putting up, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so it kind of makes sense, right? It kind of makes sense. I've been hoping I've been hoping that, you know, you've been coming in. You're going to come in and throw me some of those nice peacocks that you can Oh, for sure. No, I'm not, I, I mean, I can throw you some, but you got to come out with me and catch oh, some. Oh, yeah, too, I will. I will. I'm, I'm going to you know go out with you. I'm definitely going to go out with you. double twice as fun than oh, Oh yeah, upset. but yeah, we'll, yeah. Uh, we'll definitely do that. Yeah, and so. and also, there's some other spots too that there's some other type of fish, other exotics that right. uh, we're going to be going on. You know, different adventures trying to catch them. Right. If we catch the good specimens and stuff like that, we can bring them back to the facility and you know yeah. further you know learn about them and stuff if like you guys, that. Guys, anybody on my channel that wants to go out with Raj to go on a fishing tour, he does promote them a lot. He goes out also with yeah, the ninja. Yeah, it's pretty laid back. You guys get yeah. to come, you know, it's, it's pretty personal too. You guys get to come with me, go on a ninja, whoever, whatever guest I'm with or whatever person I'm with. Yeah. And then also you guys get to basically just kind of go on a really cool adventure. So it's really, yeah. like what you guys see in the videos is like, you're gonna be able to experience that like real, like, you know, in first yeah, hand. Yeah, he has taken me to some spots. <laughs> He's taken me to some spots that, that are unbelievable that I never expected yeah. what was there. I and mean, then we had guests such and as real cool. Every spot we go by. to, every spot we go to, there's always something crazy happening. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Always, always. You never know. Yeah. yeah, that was the time that we had that uh that macaroni uh, hamburger helper with the iguana tail. Well, I mean that day had a bunch of surprises. Every, oh. every day, a bunch of surprises, a lot always, of fun. So if you want to do one, you know, uh just uh, let us know. on Facebook and we were like talking and then we seen this ad so we're here today and stuff like that to uh, you know see their show is that what you guys are here doing too yeah what do you what do you guys what do you guys think is in the in the show is there a fish or is there I don't know we're going now we're gonna see so nobody knows fish. right no it's the first time that this mm -hmm. is where are y'all from here Hollywood Hollywood yeah oh so so you know about the infestation of the oh yes there's all yeah I almost <laughs> ran one over on around the, the way uh, here at the gas station oh I gotta give you a shirt <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Telephone lines. Yeah, yeah. They're, yeah, they're, uh, it's surprising where we're seeing a lot of them at, to say the least. You know, like they're everywhere. Roads, telephone, you know. I, but, um, yeah, it's quite, a, it's quite a bit of them. What about fish? Do you guys like fishing or do you guys go hunting or anything like that? Or? Uh, we just have an aquarium. I have, I keep frogs. I have in the past. Would you, would you call it an aquarium? Yeah. Huh? Aquarium. 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 Fish aquarium. Oh, okay. okay. I have frogs in my, um, Oh, you have frogs? Yeah. Oh, what kind of frogs? They have Pac-Man frogs. Oh, watch out, watch out. Hey, 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 in the front yard, I mean, just in your yard. <laughs> <laughs> Hollywood, dude. This is Hollywood. Oh, right there in my uh... the mouth of my dog. Oh, oh yeah. your dog, your dog. Oh, your dog's oh, yeah. got one too. Dog. Oh, wow. Love, love the dog thing. I get it. Yeah. I'm yeah. really happy that you guys. Yeah. They're actually over. in the, in the yeah. front yard. It's in the yard. Right? Yeah. 
I open the door yeah. and there's a Check huge out our one. Channel it's gigantic. On that. And you and yeah. like if you don't do anything, if you, like at some point somebody's gonna have to do something in certain areas where there's a lot of them. You know? Yeah. It's just the reality of it. So that's what we're trying to tell the people. But there, it seems like they're like they're putting it in their like back burner. You know? It's like it's like in the yeah. back of their catalog. They don't really care. But they just keep. Yeah. Breathing. And what they don't. I see little ones. Oh yeah. 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 The, um, yeah. What air it's crazy. Do you it's crazy. What air rifle do I recommend? Yeah. Okay. All of them. <laughs> no, uh, well. Okay, I'd say if, depending on your budget, if you uh, you can get a, a break barrel gamo, which is really good at deterring iguanas and euthanizing them. If you got, a, it depends on your coin though. If you could, you know, if you got, you can get a PCP air rifle. There's a couple of them in like the five hundred to a thousand dollar price range. And then if you're very serious about it, like an FX or something like that, it's like a, for a thousand bucks you're in the game. And here's the thing. You you uh, it's you buy once you cry once. Once you buy the initial investment, it's super cheap to use it. It's super cheap yeah. and so it might seem like a lot up front, but trust me, bud, when you have yeah. that, it's gonna be worth it. You know? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Like. <laughs> yeah. 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 So it's just you know. You see that? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they might have to start using them one day. There's a lot. There's that many of them. We don't want to go that far, yeah. but. <laughs> yeah. 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 They're always so there's up there. three or four in the yard. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, get a nice little air rifle, put a couple traps. And here's the thing homeowners, like, we're going to have to, people are going to have to realize and, like, learn how to, you know, take care of their yard from them, too, as well. So having little traps, having little air guns, you know, stuff like that, trimming and stuff like that can definitely deter iguanas, you know? Figure out the fishing pole thing. And, and having a snare, yeah, that's, you know, so we're going to actually be doing some videos on that because we're going to be doing, like, some, like, series on, like, yeah. trying to teach people, okay. like, homeowners, like, at least how to, like, do the basic things to protect your yard from iguanas. Yeah. You know? Uh, also, recipes and an episode on how to cook them. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We're going to do some more we'll in-depth stuff. You know, we've been kind of, you know, we're going to we're gonna do some more in-depth okay. stuff like that, more in-detail stuff. Yeah. So, yeah. Something yeah. to look forward There's to in the future. There's plenty of stuff. I made a barbecue, I made a barbecue style the other day, which was really good. I put it in the crock pot, okay, and I used... Uh, Onions, chopped peppers, on a drink? Um, Sorry, I, I, chopped peppers, some garlic, and uh, sweet baby rays. They don't sponsor me, right. but I use I use sweet baby I use sweet baby rays, and I put it in the crock pot, and I let it go for 12 hours. That meat just comes right off the bone, and it's better than pulled pork. It's delicious. So like you said, it's grass fed. Yeah, you should try it. Yeah. Try it, so, yeah. and it's an easy dish. You can't mess that up. Can't mess yeah. that up. Just take off the head. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna do some we're gonna do like a uh, new series coming up, so you'll see all that stuff. Yeah. And we're gonna make it like you know pretty like we're not you know we're gonna edit it nice so it, everybody can see it and enjoy it and understand. You know, okay. the new motto I guess I hear is like if you can't beat them, join them, eat them, just eat them. Yeah, exactly. And that's you know, and hey, hey I mean chicken of the tree. <laughs> that's it. They're magically delicious. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. So. All right. We'll see you guys inside. We'll see you right. I gave your I gave your husband yep. my yep. card, and okay. he'll explain to you. I'm gonna send you a shirt for stopping us. Oh. Okay. okay. So get get a hold of me on there. All right. And and let me know, and I'll send you okay. a shirt. Cool. See you. Yeah. I'll see you on. Nice YouTube. to meet you guys. Yep. All right. Nice meeting you. Thanks for coming Thank by. Thank you. As you can see, folks, people people yeah. from yeah. all well, walks of work okay. constantly yeah. hit us up. And you know, as as we've been growing in this game. As we've been growing in this game, we we definitely been you know having more and more. So stick by, guys. We're having we're gonna have a blast. So as 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 you asked, you know I'm doing a lot of stuff on the farm. Yeah. I, it's a big thing to me because uh, you know as you remember my story from you know when I first met you. Right. You know I, I went into that real bad depression, got out of everything. Yep. So now, now since I'm, I've done all of this stuff with the iguanas and all of that. You're out here helping the community. I'm stuff. helping the community, helping you know, uh, we're doing all kinds of stuff with with government housing, helping them. They yes. can't afford, you know, the, you know, the the agencies can't afford it, and there's a lot of elderly that live there. We've been yeah, you know, they they yeah exactly. We've been, dude. we've it's been horrible, just going it's we, horrible. we've been just going in there and doing it, but I've been slowly incorporating back my my aquatics life. And yeah. I, you know, and I tell you, it, I it's that. it's been it's been great. If I didn't have Grabby, you know, to, to help me, you know, and Grab, Grabby's and, been that guy. Yeah, and you know, and of course Ollie, you know, with his, with his video team, and, and yeah. all of that, and then you know, you know, every once in a while the serve comes around, he helps out, you know. Um, 
it, it's been it's been coming along, and I'm real happy with it. And That's you know, what it's about, dude. It's the iguana people united, yeah, and y'all helping the environment, helping the ecosystem, and helping each other. You know, you guys got each other's backs. I love it. It's like a family thing, and like you know, like from where you guys started and to where you guys are at now, right. is is pretty insane, dude. Right. You know what I'm saying? From you know, and then from nothing to yeah. Like, and we're the almost... thing is, the thing is, is right now, like you're just literally right now, you're like basically planting a seed, dude. Yeah. That's what you're doing right now, and then once that seed is planted, and you guys keep taking care of it, it's gonna grow and grow, yep. and it's gonna yep. be, it's gonna, who knows, it, it's gonna be insane, dude. I've it's been sending T-shirts all the way over to Germany because people, people like just like the iguana people concept. That, thank you guys for all your help, man. If it, if it wasn't for any of you guys, I couldn't had never put together this aquatic thing. I appreciate all the help that you guys yeah. been, been helping, buying the T-shirts, sending me dollars, yo. That's really nice. It means a lot. And all the 5,000 subs now. Yeah, that's that's you know? incredible, dude. Yeah, that's I'm it. really, and then, you know, hey, I appreciate you. You know, you, you know, all these guys, like, you know, Zach Ketchum. I got to say them all. Joey Slayum, you know, Blue Gabe. Inspirations, that, right? All of them. Yeah, they were Legends. all, all people Legends. that, that kind of, you know, took my fat ass off the couch and said, you know. Inspired you. Yeah, and that was it. And here I am. And here you are. Doctor said I was going to be <laughs> dead two years ago. Here I am. Here we are, buddy. Here we are. Yeah. So let's, awesome. go inside let's go inside and see what's going on. Let's do it, man. So obviously they're giving shopping bags out over here. This lovely lady is giving shopping bags out. Oh my goodness! I can't wait for this show, guys. We do uh, invasives. So we, we handle we we clean out the invasives in the, in the area. Nice. And uh, we try and keep everything. Oh, we're 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 in the South Florida Gulf uh, Coast Aquarium Society. So uh, we put this thing all together. I hope you guys can go in and see something that you're interested in. I used to be involved in the koi. Uh, uh, game many years ago. They have some people in there with your coin. Really? Yeah. I'll have to check that out. I'll have to check that out. Enjoy. I wonder if Joe Pollock is here from Blackwater Green. Oh, they got Johan. Koi. They got Koi over there. I used to be all alive. These look like de decorative Koi. They're not so alive. Where are these Koi out of? Where are these koi from? Those are domestic koi. I know they are, but where, where, what from farm are they from? Originally? Yeah. Oh, jeez. They... Some of my bread and some of my buy different places. There's a few koi. I have to go look at them because I can scream with them. Right. Know, some of the farms have just closed down. Oh, I know, I know. I used to be in it. Bees and all that stuff. Oh, yeah, cage bee, all of that stuff. Yeah, yeah. I was just wondering what farm it was. No, no, no. I got a couple of places. And some of my breed. Where are you guys at? We're located in Homestead, uh, actually in the Redlands, in between Miami and um, Homestead. Do you mind being on YouTube at all? Oh, no. no. We do okay. it all the time. I've been on it a few times uh, with Blake. Okay, okay. You, you, you've been on with Blake then? Blake, and I've been on with the Aquarium Co-op. Okay. He's been out to the farm. And I'll, have to, I'll have to make a visit. Is that okay? Can yeah, I, what's your name? My name is Johan. I'm with Sunset Aquatics. Oh, yeah. Definitely, definitely come. Josh would be the guy to talk to. Actually, we did a one with Blake because I got a big pit uh, and we drained it down. Right. And, and it's called uh, Monster Fish Released in Lagoon. Right, right. And, and we have some 80 pound popcorn and stuff like that. So we get all kinds okay. of stuff. Yeah, we awesome. can set something up for you. And no, I've been building. I've been building actually right now. I've been, I've been, I got right now, I'm almost done with two 5,000 gallon tanks. I'm okay. getting ready to do four more. Yeah, you know, uh, well, we love people coming out in video and yeah. stuff. Yeah, you don't have a card, do you? Yeah, I do. Uh, my guy Grabby here has got. I'll one. give it to Josh, and you guys should be in contact. Uh, oh. Yep. We do invasives. We, we we pull all invasives out of the Everglades everywhere. Okay. We, we handle you know snakes, iguanas. Okay. Okay. You know, we're just starting to get right back into the aquaculture. I tell you, I met a guy. He's a retired miller. He just moved back to Oklahoma, but he would go boat fishing. Right. So he got into this thing, they were hunting iguanas. And right. I bought a rod, it's like a bull gun. Right. Have you seen it? Yeah. And uh, you, you flip the bale on it and shoot Yeah, I seen that. Uh, I think so I seen that he kid. He took people, his name was Donovan. Who? Donovan. He just moved back to Oklahoma. But right. he would take people out on his flatboat right. and uh, 
and they would go down to canals, and he'd get 450 bucks to take four people. Yeah. And he was book solid. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. So he had yeah, to buy him I have boats. a lot of people that are always trying to come out to go out to catch iguanas <laughs> all the time. Yeah. yeah. But now they're, you know, <laughs> they're out there. Probably. Yeah, I have to get rid of them. Yes, they, they do. They're a oh, nuisance man. to me. All right, well, we'll catch you on a rebound. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll, tell, I'll tell Josh, and his, his number's on the... Uh, yeah. I got them. I got all my stuff. I'm going to put it in my bag yeah. here. Do you get fish out of the canals, too? Bro? Yeah, we get all, all kinds of stuff. Yeah, that might be interesting because we got a couple of things donated to the friend of fish and all that. Right. We got the pit with the 80 pound box in there. Yeah, yeah. A couple of red tail cats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, he's at home. All right. He has to do the Moving on. That's driftwood, Johan. Wow, what's up? I'm a wood guy. What can I say? You're a wood guy. Yeah, I'm a wood guy. Wood guy. Yeah. I'm an iguana guy. Oh, that's dope. I like that. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all of these over here, man. Look. Some wild stuff. Where are they from? Yeah, they do. They do. Yeah, they do this little crap. Where are they located? Let me get it. I think you said Sebastian. Oh, okay. Cool. Essentially, we're just right there. What kind of crab is that? Uh, panther crab. Oh, nice. <laughs> I'm a truck driver. Wow. Glad to come around the other side. Look, they got goldfish over there, too. Look at all the fish, Johan. Yeah. Uh, you leave. Place is full and crowded. Wow, look at the look at the koi. You have to wait. I'm sorry. Wow. This is why I have to get back in the business. You see the prices of on them? Very expensive. Yeah, probably a fraction of that price. Y'all gonna need some? Hit me up. The direction will be below. Discus fish? Yeah, they have to stay in like 80 or 90 degree water, I think. They're beautiful. You guys raise all these? Yeah. Where are, you Where are you guys from? Port St. Lucie, sir. Port St. Lucie. You guys are on YouTube. You don't mind being on YouTube, do you? Cool. No problem. Oh, look at that. You guys do other cichlids too? No. Just these? These goose and the angel fish. Right. A and angels? Yeah. Oh, okay. Right. Yeah. Wow. Well, you do any these are koi angels, right? Yeah. Yeah. Those are the best. How much are they a piece? Oh. If I had my system all set up, I would be buying them all. <laughs> Next night or more, tomorrow, tomorrow we'll be well, here. Well, you're close to me. I, I'm putting up a, I'm putting up a, a, a system in uh, Okeechobee. I'm going to have 50,000 gallons. So when I'm done, this Koi Angels are my favorite. Discus were my face, first favorite. You know? But uh, I also like Koi fish. So, you know, so I kind of dabble in them. I deal with invasive species, so I go out to the Everglades and we, we catch like iguanas, pythons, and, and now we're going to start to dabble in the invasive fish. Because there's a lot of stuff out there, like tailed cats, octoons, and all that. So we're going to bring that to our channel, that's why we're hooking that up. You know? So we might call you guys yes. and come and see you sometime. Is that okay? No problem. Yes, anytime you want it. Yes, yes. What's your name? Juan. Juan. Juan and I'm Johan. Nice to meet you. Same yeah. name. <laughs> so different language. Exactly. <laughs> These here are uh, like, like, like the fish can go into them. Like, I, I think I've seen crayfish like hanging out in these things before. But you know, you put these in for cichlids, so cichlids can go in and hide. You know? a fish, you know, a fish likes a place to go in and hide. You know, so mainly the cichlids they go inside of here. You know, so I'm gonna get one of these these cards here. Keep that. Oh, look at these guys. 
75. Was that an Eel Johan? It's a loach, I think. Oh, look at this That is very nice. This is awesome. This is something that you sit inside and you grow stuff out, keep turtles in. Hey, pretty. Beautiful. Yeah, I like I like that. I like the I like the colors on it. Look at that. That bushy nose pleco there. Golden pleco. Beautiful. Got some plecos here too. Look at these guys. Awesome. I can't wait to set up the tanks. This guy does beautiful art, man. You know, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want to, if you want to go to his his site, you can uh, you can just go to the way that's spelled. Scales. S C A L Z. Scales. Green shows, I do the freshwater shows, and I do the reptile shows. And then I do fishing conventions too. Wow. <laughs> hey, tell all guys how they can how they can reach you. Oh, they can meet me anywhere. I'm everywhere. <laughs> I, this is my 17th show this year. Okay. I, uh, I this is my, not my last one for the year. I actually have to go to OCA Extravaganza. I'll be diving in the pool with the giant arapaimas and oh, no. and uh, alligator gars and giant red tail cats and stuff like that. But you can find me anywhere. My name is. There we go. Sam Scales. Sam Scales. And that, that is my. Instagram and my Facebook and then if you want to go and get some any of my clothing that I do or any of the artwork it's just scales.com not, not hard yeah. do not add an a there's no I mean an e there's no e in scales yeah cool all right there you go guys and look at some of this beautiful art that he's got yeah. this, this is this is beautiful man I'm very nice you can paint this, bro. I yeah <laughs> No, I, was, I, I, was, I was gonna I was gonna say if you were local I was gonna say dude if you were local I was like we're definitely gonna collab with you want us bro. I'm yeah. practically local. Yeah. Four, this is my fourth trip to, to Florida this year. Yeah. I've been in Vegas 14 times this year. <laughs> so, so this this is not, this is my third. And then every year in Ohio. Always. Wow. So you can you can draw so maybe we can get some iguanas going from this guy. Yeah, that'd, I mean, be, that'd be that'd that's, be that's a good thing. No? Yeah, it's something awesome. you can put it on your YouTube. Yeah, yeah. Like like some shirts. That'd be awesome. Yeah. yeah. Shirts are always a good thing. I do. I mean, if you look over here, I do. I do some of the. I have, you know some herbs. Oh yeah. Right that. I've got there's a yellow belly sea snake right there. Oh look at that, huh? And then um, there's a. Chameleon. Oh yeah, look at that chameleon. Ain't quite a Florida chameleon, but you know. Yeah. <laughs> nice though. Nice, real nice. I'm sure you guys know spots for like veiled chameleons and stuff. Like yeah. That. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, I mean, there's spots for them, but you know, there's also a lot of hunters for them too. You know, yeah. everybody's out there catching. Yeah. Everybody's like, you're starting to get pretty uh, possessive there for spots. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. It's kind of like fishing spots. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. We never reveal. They can't. Hey, great to meet you guys. It's always nice to meet somebody new, guys. So guys, I guess uh, we're gonna go out to a hunt right now, and uh, we'll see you at the next spot. We had a great time together. Yeah, so it was a lot of fun, a lot of cool people. Yeah, man. Uh, we're going out to a hunt right now, so stick by.